Yo, what's going on, sexy Sam Linder squad? Everybody, they want to rank one v one, but it's try hard Thursday, so you know we got to try hard. And you know, let's be honest, boys. We all know that maybe I've been taking it a little bit too easy on these people. Maybe, maybe my try hard Thursdays have become more, more like the old school me Mondays. You know, like I, I picked some gods. This series started because I wanted to show off how unbelievably bad I would slaughter the entire dual community if I decided to try. If, if I decided to try. That's not true. I'd still lose about half of my games because I'm dog shit. But if I decided to try, then I would be good. Okay? Actually good. That's what this series started as. People wanted to see, Sam, what happens when you go fucking hard. And then, you know, I did some episodes. I, I did some some videos where you know, maybe I'm trying hard on gods that I don't normally play. You know, maybe maybe it's more like, uh, take it how you feel. You know? I played with the integrity of Try Hard Thursday. Far too much. Far too much. I'm over it. No more am I messing with Try Hard Thursday. I'm going back to basics, showing you guys what to do, okay? I'm showing you what to do. Now, obviously, I'm fighting a raw. Raw early game, hard, hard, hard on the mana usage. He really needs blue buff in order to sustain himself. Me, I'm actually pretty good on the mana. I got 500 mana. I got some MP5 from Transcendence. I got the multi pots kicking in. You know, I'm I'm chilling with my mana, and I got 500 uh, base mana. My two only cost 40. I can clear the whole wave with only 100 mana. So I'm chilling. So instead of going for my blue buff, what I need to do is make sure he can't get his, because that is try our Thursday, baby. I clear the wave. I go for the blue. We see what happens. If he comes over here, I simply drop it. I don't care. I don't care. What are you going to do? Take it? I'd love to see you try. I'd love to see you try. Exactly. I know what these gods are capable of. Don't go messing around. Don't go messing around. Do you want to come get this? Oh, don't you just die here, though? But don't you just die here, though? Oh, I missed. All right. Well, you would be dead. If I was, if I was a skilled individual, you'd be so deceased right now. He has blue or or uh, beads. I mean. So what I'm going to do is this. Get the blue buff. Now we get the kill. Super simple. Dead. Peace out, brother. The Bastet cat tanks the tower. And the Bastet does the rest. That's how we do. Actually, I'm just going to go back right now. I'm going to grab a chalice and go for my blue. Oh, this is remarkable. I've never seen anything like it. I want five minute surrenders today. I want a bunch of five minute surrenders. I want people to feel like they're getting thrashed and they have to sit in their fountain until five minutes to surrender. That's my goal. I'm telling you, man. I'm telling you. The brakes are off, boys. I'm going full throttle. All right, do, do your little damage. Do your little damage. See if I care. That's right. Me and my transcendence will take you on. Sure. 
after the wave. And back. And simply back. So leader, tier two. I am double stacking here. <coughs> and I know that if I'm trying to get them to five minutes surrender, then obviously going pure pure uh, power spike is better. So like a uh, Jotun's here would probably be better or even just a defensive item uh, by itself would be better. But I'm, I, I know that Raw's potential is decent. Where are you going? Oh, close. Close, 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 close. Almost at him. I think I slightly overestimated the shot. Very, very slightly. Look at that damage, man. I'm going to kill you. You think I won't kill you? You think I won't end you right now? By the way, this does have to be said. Uh, this is not personal by any means. I'm going equally as tough against every single person today. I'm playing actual tryhard. I'm playing S tier gods. I'm not pulling the punches. All right. He did get the blue, but I don't really care that much. Let's just get the wave. <clears throat> we'll back. We'll go soul eater. And then we'll go Genji's. Second relic, what am I thinking? Now we could continue with the hyper aggression and go blink. Or I could simply slow it down, but keep up the aggression during fights. But I don't know. I'm thinking, I'm thinking we're going to go hyper aggressive still. Look at me go, baby. Hey, yeah. Obviously, the soul leader is going to take a little bit of getting used to. It's got to stack up. Bro, that damage is actually gnarly. If you didn't know, uh, you can actually, you can 180 uh, when the raw is trying, <coughs> excuse me, you can 180 when raw is trying to blind you and it won't blind you. It'll still do the damage, but it just won't blind you. Perfect. Big damage. We got breastplate of regrowth. Damn, I should have been able to kill there. Big juke. Damn, I still don't have fire minions yet. When do these boys come in? When are my boys coming? Oh, but I got the treasury. I got the treasury. Check that over there so I can keep tabs on him. If you didn't know one attack from your cat will apply your passive, which basically means you have like a permanent ward on them. All right. That might kill. Uh, close. A warrior never 
All right, I almost have my passive. I'm sorry. I almost have my soul eater passive. I don't know why he thought he was going to get me there. Your guess is as good as mine, boys. And I know, I know that there's probably some people thinking, Sam, I liked the Tri Art Thursday the way it was. I like seeing you actually play gods that you never really play, but still be like decent on them. And while I'll say, yeah, it can be a little fun. It could be fun. Don't get me wrong. I'm dead. Um, it could be fun, right? But you're not really tryharding if you're playing gods that you don't fully understand, right? Like if you're actually tryharding, which is the, the name of the series, which is the reason I started it. If you're actually tryharding, you're playing gods that you know the ins and outs of, that you have hundreds of hours on, if not thousands. And you're utilizing every aspect of it, right? Granted, Bastet is more of just like an S tier pick. I don't play a whole lot of Bastet. I know I have a couple thousand worshippers on her, but I don't play a whole lot of her. So like, it's a little different. I mean, I guess for some people, a couple thousand worshippers is enough to call it try hard, but... I am slowly taking the Phoenix back. It'll take a while. It'll take a, it'll take a minute. But I'll get there. Look at that. Look at that. You're dead. Big healing from the alt and the soul leader. And that, my friends, is going to be the first game of 40. That's right. I'm playing 40 games. This is going to be a 36 hour long video. I'm just kidding. I'll see you guys in game two. Welcome back, boys, to game number two. And you might see the master's border. It's Chronos time. I'm, I'm whipping out the Kronos. World Bread 8. Wait, there used to be a guy in my stream called World Bread. Is this him? If only they could see the world as I see No, nah, probably not. Because he only has 1,800 MMR. And if you're watching me, you got more than 1,800 MMR. That's for sure. Um, Now, here's the thing. I could be really passive. Uh, But I'm not gonna. I think I'm going to go full on freaking aggro mode and just W key the crap out of him. Whether he's at red buff, blue buff, yellow buff, purple buff, 11, 11 buff, whether he's in the gym getting buff, doesn't matter. I'm running at him. Hola, senor. I'm running at him. I can't be stopped. I can't be stopped. I won't be stopped. Big fan keep with the content. Thank you so much. I will. Thank you so much. I will. Huge many appreciate. No, sir. So 
What are you doing? You can't win this. I won't allow it. I'm going to use my extra damage mode to help with my clear a little bit. Just a teensy bit. Uh, I'm not even going to get my... I'm not even going to get my ult. He's so low. All right. It's fine. Let's just grab this and be on our way. I'm still not going to get my ult, by the way. Time waits for no man. Um, let's see. I kind of wanted to go to wave first instead of let him have pressure, but then I remembered like I already got everything on the map. So if he has pressure, what is he pressuring? As if, you know, like <laughs> as if he has any pressure. <laughs> so it's, this is my world. I'm, I'm currently letting you live in it. Say thank you. You're wondering why I used my horn shard. It's because I needed to get slightly more ahead. Slightly faster ahead in order to cast the one. I told you, I'm not messing around today, dude. I'm not I'm not fudging around today. Peep this, peep this, peep this, peep this. Nope. I'll take that. Thank you. Thank you. All right. I look like somebody's blue just spawned. Be a shame if someone were to take that from you, wouldn't it? Hello. Okay. Or not. Now, hello. Okay. Oh, that hit. Kind of wasn't expecting that hit, to be honest. I'm waiting for red. He just, he just showed up and got bopped and ran back away. <laughs> I'll take it. I still don't have my ult, by the way. I know what you're thinking, Sam. You said this would be opt optimal play. And this is definitely not optimal. No, I promise you. I promise you. In optimal play, do you need to rewind eight seconds? Think about it. Think about it. If you're playing perfectly, then rewinding eight seconds would just put you backwards eight seconds. It won't give you an advantage. Huh? There you go. Chrono Salt is a crutch. You shouldn't use it. You heard it from me first. Give me blue buff, please. I would like the mana. I fully expected him to ult me there. Okay. And he surrendered. Oh, see you guys in game three. A GG gamer.
what's up boys i'm back i'm back hello game three i'm playing some poseidon a little bit of pool siding to to wet the whistle if you will the good old pool siding now you might notice hey sam if you play so much poseidon why you why you got a flat border well i'll tell you why so i do this thing on stream called instruct bot or what i call Bitbot. basically it allows people to donate money however much they want to basically in order to mess me up in game use my abilities use my ultimates use my relics or straight up surrender the game for some freaking reason i don't know the reason for some reason uh because i've never i haven't lost on poseidon in the past year uh however i have three losses now because people keep making me f6 when i play poseidon using my bitbot the last time I played Poseidon. Sit down if you're not. Hold on. They made me to surrender to a man who was zero wins, 16 losses, 900 MMR. That's why I have a platinum border. <laughs> but make no mistake, this platinum border holds more power than most master borders. Make no mistake. I'm I'm a strong-willed individual with power beyond comparison. Yes, I always horn shard on the first wave. Why do I horn shard on the first wave? Glad you asked. Because it gives me a ton of pressure. Pressure to very, very easily get the minis on red buff, which guarantees level 5 on this wave, which guarantees the fact that I will have pressure forever because that's just how Poseidon is. Hello. Beads. Interesting. Now, are you deceased? Oh, I'm dead. Oh, I'm not dead. Wait. All right, I backed. He also backed, by the way. I saw him spawn back in. So he's going to get red buff. But we got his beads for my ult. And I have my beads for his ult. So next time I have Kraken, as long as I three, um, then I just guaranteed get a kill. Probably first blood. I missed. What's new? Okay. If unlucky were a person, it would be me. I could just kill him though. You know, like he goes for wave here and I just like don't let him. Kablamo. Big dead. Perfect. Now I go Genji's so we have some cooldown. Get some potions, use the two for the movement speed, and head back out there. Oh, baby. I'm feeling good today, man. I'm feeling good. Let's go. I mean, actually, physically, actually, I feel like a little bit sick. But, like, mentally, I'm fucking dead. <laughs> Never mind. When perfection meets practice, you get literally the best player to ever hit the game. It's me. It's me. Let's fucking go, dude. Let's actually go. When talent meets practice, you get perfection. 
You know who taught me that? Cristiano Ronaldo. That's my boy. I know him personally. No big deal. I'm, I'm by, by the way, I'm just letting you guys sit on that for a second. Hello. Hello. You have beads up? You do? Unlucky it wasn't enough. Because I am Poseidon. Kraken's hurt. Grab this. Oh, you already did your blue. Damn it. All right, well, I got these, though. Thank you. Now, I don't, unfortunately, have any way to survive and execute. Which, no doubt, he wants to do to me. So, what I'm going to do is... uh, I'm actually just going to not get executed. Oh, please tell me you're sitting in base. Please tell me that I've demoralized you to the point where I have won the moral victory. Not the moral. The mental victory. And you're ju you've just given up. I told you this plat border held more power. He's in fountain. He's in fountain spamming abilities. Yes. Surrender. See you guys next game yo what's going on boys i'm back and freya is up okay now if i'm genuinely try hard thursdaying i pick freya here or a freya counter like bologna i'm down you left freya open to play raijin you are not, dude, it is, you, uh, you must be on a different day of the week. It's not Thursday for you, Christian. It's not Thursday. But today, another day, another honestly, day. it doesn't even matter, actually. Never mind. I was like, quick. I was like, it's not Thursday for him. So like, you know, maybe it's fine, but even if it was Thursday, What's he going to do? Beat me? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> ah, man. What a beautiful day, isn't it? Aren't you guys so excited, so happy about this beautiful day? Now, Christian was not the guy that I invaded for blue, so he probably doesn't think that I'm here. Okay. You don't have your three, do you? Why don't you have your three? Yo, there's no way anyone smart would like invade here, right? I was going to do it, but then I realized I'm tryharding. I'm tryharding, and I need to remember that. No memes allowed. This isn't a day for funsies. This is a day where I take souls or die trying. This is my... This is... I'm on my David Goggins shit right now, dude. Oh, ho, ho. so close. So close. All right, he has his ult. He doesn't have ult. I could have stayed. Oh, man. All right. We'll grab the early telkines. Honestly, I'll wait. I'll wait for the chalice because it's going to save me so much gold in the long run. The reason you go Telkines first, even though it only does three damage per level, is because at the 10 base is pretty good, but mainly getting it because as Freya, lifesteal is super important, and uh, you get some lifesteal from Telekines. So not only do you get the attack speed, you get the lifesteal, which is basically just going to make it that much better. Hello? This is going to hurt. 
Maybe it doesn't hurt that bad. And now you die. And now you die. Just shut that off for a second. Do some damage. And run back out. I have alt now. I dare him to jump on me. I actually dare him. I missed. Hold on. I killed him with the tower. Let's go. Let's go. I knew there was a chance I die there for sure. There was a chance I die there if he lands this too, like he did. But I mean, come on. When's the last time you saw somebody kill somebody by hitting the tower and having the two pulse from Freya actually kill? It's been a while, hasn't it? Damn, that feels good. That's a good kill. You don't scare me. You don't scare me, and I think you know that, and I think that scares you. Hello. Now you run. There he goes. There he goes. Now, you know what I could do, which would be maybe even better than Bancroft's would be just to go straight into Typhons because I have a little bit of lifesteal from uh, the Telkines anyways. I want him to use his dash on me. All right. He saved it. Oh, so close. There's no way you're staying. So he had the mana for the alt and the dash away. That's crazy. I didn't think he had the mana for both. I thought I guaranteed killed him. Because he didn't have mana. I'm actually going to take my own advice. And I'm going to go... I'm going to skip over Bancroft. And I'm going to go straight for Typhons. Because Telkines does have a little bit of lifesteal. So it might actually be okay to do this. And then I'm going to go... Straight into Demonic. Because he's going defense. And then from Demonic... Uh, maybe into Bancroft. To just further elevate my lead. Or into defense. Depending on how much damage he's dealing. Right now, his damage feels irrelevant, so I don't really care. But we'll see. He lasted longer than he did last game already. All right. We parked his Genjis. I'm gonna use my three on him while he's casting his one. Perfect. Perfect. Into the six minute surrender. All right. See you guys next game. Yo, what's up, boys? Welcome back to the next game. I've played Kronos, Bastet. I've played Poseidon. You know, I that's it? Only three? I've only played three? Oh, Freya. Um, now I could just whip out the Poseidon again. Or I could hit up with the On Her, you know? I got a lot of stars on On Her. By the way, my favorite On Her skin is actually Star Lancer. I don't know why. Um, but I like it, so I'm going to use it. 
because that's just that's just my life. We got Yadora Allah. I don't know if I said your name incorrectly or not. If I did, I'm really sorry. Uh, but I'm going to do some honor. Now, honor is actually really good against Poseidon for two reasons. One, I can simply beads and jump. But two... Excuse me. Uh, two, I can also just not. You know what I mean? I can just alt. And being able to CC immune a Poseidon alt is like being able to absolutely slap a Poseidon in the face and say, what you going to do about it, bitch? They don't know. They can't do anything. They can't do anything about it. I'm going to check MMR real quick. Tap back into the game now. 1400 MMR. Oh man, poor guy. You think I'm going to be nice to him? No. No. It's tryhard Thursday. I'm tryharding. It's Thursday. You know the deal, boys. You know the deal. There's exactly two things that can happen on a tryhard Thursday. Either I win or I don't. And there's exactly one thing I want to happen. Perfect kill. First blood, a baby. Let's actually go. That's how you fucking do it. Oh, do you think that because you died, you're allowed your blue buff? No, sir. You're not. Hello. Perfect. Thank you for the blue buff. What are these jukes? What are these jukes? Hmm? What are these jukes? Alright, now I corner him. Into the corner you go. Thank you. And I won't corner him again. We'll just corner him once. No big deal. No big deal. One simple corner. You can live fine. No, you're not, you're not missing anything. How much did that two do? Oh my God. Dude, I actually do so much damage. All right. I guess we'll just do red buff. Is he coming over here? Oh, he's backing. All right. I mean, I expected him to come over here. And if he did, I was going to I was going to eliminate him from this planet. Control alt delete if you will. What if he's being kind about it? Let's see if I can do this. So close. He's got cracking up, by the way. Hello. He was trying to bait me with a back bait so he could crack him. Not today. Maybe against inferior opponents that would work. Maybe against an inferior enemy. Let's grab this and uh honestly just give me a just give me a Jotun's. I'm going I'm going cooldown, power spike, obliteration build this game. I don't need transcendence. I don't need all the, I don't need all the assistance that all these other gamers use. I just need me and my abilities. Me 
and my abilities. I'm sorry. Not mine. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. I'm going to do it to him again, by the way. Can you get towards the wall, please? Oh my god, that actually slaughtered. That did way more damage than I thought it would. I right, know he definitely thinks I'm gone because he's like, why the fuck would this guy stay when he has 400 health? And he might be right, but also he's completely wrong. Oh, that's a tower. I'll do it again. See if I care. I'll do it again. See if I give a shit. He ran all the way around. All the way around. All right. Fair play to you. You want to crack at me so bad, don't you? <laughs> Yo, he thought the minions wouldn't kill him. He thought the minions would just let him go. Oh no. Oh no. This poor lad. Nice. Nice. Nine kills in six minutes. Nothing other than perfection, boys. Nothing other than perfection. Let's keep it rolling, though, shall we? In fact, let's get a blink. Let's get a blink. We do quite a lot of damage. Alright. Alright. You know what? You got gusto, kid. What do you think you're doing? What do you think you're doing fake backing? Hmm? Another kill. Oh, another kill. Primitive. And a tower down. Your team has destroyed a middle enemy tower. I should start pushing objectives a little bit harder. I guess I'll back. You know, I'll just go dominance actually. I was gonna go heart seeker, but I do want some more attack speed. My attack speed is a little bit too slow for my liking. I wonder if he's going to bull demon here. I wonder if he knows to check bull demon here. Oh, he did.
All right. And Bull Demon is done. Let's go get that Phoenix, shall we? Let's go grab that Phoenix. I missed. And that, my boys, actually might not be game yet. I don't do nearly as much damage as I thought I did. God, that did a lot of damage. He probably has cracking up. end of the game 14 kills in 10 minutes and i think i can probably pump out one more game for y'all before we end this video off so i'll see you guys next game what's up boys this is going to be the last game today and uh i'm wondering if i should whip out the hades or the anubis i haven't played either of them i love both of them i play them both a lot um i'd argue i play anubis probably more than hades so let's give Hades a little love, shall we? Now, I know both of them in and out. I love both of them. I like, I like playing them both. They're a lot of fun. They're, they're a frick ton of fun, actually. So I'm down. I'm down to give it a try. Lord Evil 190. Hello. Let's MMR you. And see what comes up. It wants to be released. No. I do not know how long I can... 2000 MMR. Not bad. Not bad. Um, let's go old build. I'm down to go old build. And you know what? I'm also going to go blink again, even though, even though this man has all the capacity to eliminate me from the face of the planet. Um, I think that I can, I think that I can beat him and here's why. Well, there's two reasons. One, I'm me and two, that if I blink, if I blink and then I two, he can't, re he can't retaliate. He, he has no, he has no options. He can't press any buttons. And then I three, and then I get his buff and then he loses the game. Agreed. I missed my three. I'm still down to fight. Fuck it. I think I can kill him. Actually, I know I can kill him. Pressing all those gnarly buttons. Into the archers. Oh, so close. So close, man. Just gonna let me have the red. Yeah, I'll probably let me have the red. 
I can't believe he pulled the buff that far back. That's crazy. You almost never see that anymore. People are always going aggro with their buff pulls. All right, I am I am comfortable though. I'm comfortable. Well, yes, I don't technically have a relic. I'll also, that didn't scare me at all, because if he does ult, then... Oh, well. And if he doesn't, then I'm vibing. Um, but regardless, he did get his buff, but we got double buff, and we're going to get the XP camp, because it doesn't look like he went over there. And I'm stacking book. I'm stacking a book. I was making, wondering to see if he was, he was slacking. You know, if I could catch him slacking a little bit. All right. First blood. Just like that, baby. Just like that. And his cracking is down. And I'm super not scared. Dude, I heal so much. It's actually crazy. Now we just back. Now we just back. Now we go Genji's. We go Genji's just to get the, the defense online. And then what I'll go is I'll go Divine. And then I'll go Polly. And then yada, yada, yada. And then I win the game. Easy. Easy. Just like that baby like clockwork like cockwork clock cock clock cocking cocks clock you know what i mean boop, boop. not bad seems like treasure just spawned honestly there's not much for me to do here other than annoy him like this. Just because I can. You know what I could have done? I don't know actually for a fact if I could have gotten away there. I think what I could have done is I could have canceled my alt and dashed away. But I was on a whirlpool, and the only reason I didn't cancel my alt and dash away is because I assumed that whirlpool would kill me because it would catch me and um and then I'd be just be dead there. That's what I assumed, but that assumption could have been wrong, actually. And more than likely, it was wrong. But regardless, you make a mistake. No big deal. Hello? He pressed all of his buttons very fast. Also, you got to remember, too, I'm going the book build. Which is basically like worse early game, but demolishes late game with Polly. Um, I should probably go divine. I'm just gonna clear his wave back here. There's literally nothing on the map for me to do, so just find and work for myself. Hello? Okay. Maybe the treasure chests are up. They are not. Let's see if my uh, cancel dash works. 
doesn't work. All right. Interesting. Interesting. Dead to archers. <clears throat> Dead to archers. Nice try, buddy boy. And you got to remember, by the way, I'm doing this with an offensive relic that doesn't work while getting cracking. When I get Aegis, it's actually just over. It's it's unironically over. Also, let's get Divine. I didn't realize I had enough for an entire Divine. Seems like he's going Divine as well, but I didn't build any Bancrofts. So Divine doesn't mess with me as hard as it messes with other people. Other people in this case being him. Not gonna go for the red. All right. Fair play. I'll do it myself. Oh, I can I can definitely kill him here. Pop. And there's the blink coming in handy a little bit. There's the blink coming in handy a little bit. And he does have divine, but like who cares, you know? Who cares? Like I said, I don't have I don't have poly. I don't have breastplate. I don't have any of that shit. I mean, I'm not breastplate. I meant Bancrofts. They both start with a B. We're an hour and 10 minutes into the video. It's fine. You understand. <laughs> hmm. I'm thinking maybe instead of Polly next, what if I just went staff? Because this build does utilize staff very well. Also, there's no way on planet Earth that I, like, ever kill him. Alright. That's pretty funny, actually. He used all of his abilities. He used all of his abilities to try to stop me from backing. <laughs> he didn't have enough to clear the wave. And he had to wait for his next rotation of abilities to clear the wave. That's pretty funny. I would love that blue buff, my friend. Hello. Thank you. Oh, there's like literally nothing up. He's a big runny boy. He's a big runny. That's all right. I don't mind a big runny. All right, you're dead to my ult. Doesn't matter. Oh, we got the ages. Polly. Whoa, my Polly didn't didn't connect. That's pretty weird. I thought for sure my poly would connect there. Oh, we got his Kraken. So. Alt for an offensive relic, I will definitely take. Go get red. You cannot stop this. Oh, I didn't even need the poly auto. Damn. This damage be nasty. What's up, brother? Pop. Pop. not going that way I'm not going that way 
And you know, I'm only 700 gold off a of full staff. What's stopping me from just waiting? Because like realistically, I got two options. I back now, get some shitty tier two item that I don't really care about. Or I just wait for the full thing. No sense half-assing it. Let's just grind it out. Up. I'll take the blue. Thank you very much. And then I will take the wave. Thank you very much. And then I'll go get my Mirrodin. And then with Mirrodin, I kill Titan. Open game. Easy peasy. And by Titan, obviously, I mean full demon. But, you know, potato, potato, tomato, tomato, patabada, pala, patobada, kala. You know what I mean? Like sometimes it's how, that's just how things work these days. I think. Potato, potato, tomato. I think what I can do, actually, is bait bull demon. Kill him while he goes for wave. And then just clear with, with the thing. Correct? Oh, he saw my wing or some shit. All right, well, now he doesn't think... Now he doesn't think that I'm ever going to go Bull Demon. Which is fine by me. What are you doing? Okay. That fear was actually a gamer. It was actually gamer. Can I do bull demon yet, dude? Oh, what the? Hello? I think he's got a ward on it, huh? Seems like this dude's definitely got a ward. He's gonna kill me or something? Is that your plan? Really good damage, by the way. I wonder if I can snag a uh, a cheeky little corner on him. He does have Aegis. But I got... But I got damage. He's got Aegis, but I got damage. Only using my abilities for the poly, obviously. That is a lot of Titan damage, my boys. Actually, just a shit ton of Titan damage. I'm going to go back. Oh, he held it, dude. He held it. Well played. Well played. Um, now here's, here's what I can do. I do only have 10% cooldown, so I can either, I can sell this for a Chronos Pendant and a 500 pot and get max cooldown. Or I could get a 3k pot and keep the bow. I think, honestly, I would much rather max cooldown than more damage. For sure. And I have the blink. Like, I just blink ult him, right? He has beads, sure, but, like, I should be fine. If he krakens me, I just stay in the ult. If he if he three and then krakens, I might die, but we'll see. 
Honestly, I could just I could just fight him under his Phoenix. I mean his his Titan. GG. The GG uh, gamers. That was an actual tryhard Thursday. I'm tryharding. It's Thursday. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And until next time, 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 time. Peace.